Hey guys, welcome back to more AFK Arena. In today's video, we're going to be collecting a Belinda from one of our chests, getting her ascended, and then testing her with Lawson against Riz because the combo just seems amazing, and hopefully we can do some amazing damage. So, let's get into this video. First things first, we have the 30k giveaway winner to announce. Sorry my, my face cam goes fuzzy whenever I use... PC screen capture, I have no idea. But anyway, this is the video. As you can see down the bottom here, bottom right, we've got 16.6K views, 2.22K comments. So a fair few to get through. Uh, 988 likes and 10 dislikes. Ooh, yeah, we just make bad content. Okay, we're going over here to randomcommentpicker.com and we'll place it in here, filter duplicates. If we go Control V, uh, get YouTube comments. Okay, 200, 300, stacking up, stacking up. Let's go, come on. This always takes longer and leaves it really, really awkward. Really awkward. Okay, nice. 2147, we're filter filtering the duplicates so multiple comments from the same person don't give you multiple entries. You know what I'd find funny? If I actually won this, this would be nuts. But we come down here, uh, let's go. I think that's it. I think that's all I have to do. Let's go. Let's see what happens. Let's see what happens. Rob Hargett. Thank you for helping people with this game. Thank you for commenting and winning the $100 gift. Uh, if you could please, uh, Rob Hargett, if you could please, I love it when it's names that I can say. If you could please just edit your winning comment with a, uh, make a dummy email address or give me a Discord uh, user ID and then I'll hit you up and get you your prize. But congratulations everyone else, better luck next time. But now that that's over, we can jump over here, we can close the PC screen and we can jump onto this. Now, let's get over into it. We've wasted, not wasted some time, we've invested some time into the giveaway. Uh, now we can go over to the Temple of Ascension before we do that, rip. We can come over here. Well, it's obviously not going to be in that one. It is going to be in this one. We're going to choose. Thank you. Now we're going to go back over to the Temple of Ascension. We are going to find my little Belinda's. There they are. That's not Belinda. There she is. Yoink. Do that. Now, we drop that. We go like this, and we go like that, and we go like that. I think I've got this right. We are recording, so we're not going to miss it. Happy days. Ascend. Yes. Always satisfying. And Belinda's one that I just, I've just i wanted to get sat ascended for so long because she's just good for Riz. She's really good for Riz. She synergizes well with Lawson. So what we're going to do, we're going to go over here. We're going to remove her gear. Sweet. We're going to go over here. We're going to equip her gear. We're going to go over... The rickety, the rickety, we're going to reset you. Yeah, we'll reset you. Because you, you, you don't need to be there. You don't need to be there. And we're going to go, please do not try and go to 240. Th that is so frustrating. You know what we're going to do? We're going to do this. We're going to do this. Nope, we're not going to do that one. Wait, hold up. This uh, Life hacks, life hacks. Here we go. Remove you from the crystal. Where are you? Where's the Thalia? There she is. Convert. Yoink. Now, check this out. Pro plays to get around it. We're going to go Thalia. Boost because she can only go to 200. Yes. And we're going to ascend her soon anyway. That's an upcoming video. Upcoming video. Thalia ascended. Uh, and then we can simply go Belinda. Yes. Got it. Yes. Life hacks. That's how you get around it. I really wish they'd give you a level choice of like the level cap below the one that it's offering you because it's really quite frustrating. So unfortunately, all this gear is, she doesn't get the same bonus as Shamira does, but hey, it's okay. We're going to go like that. Then we've got Lawson over here, who we are going to remove some gear to hopefully help him survive a little bit. So we're going to use Rosaline as well. She's got some nice gear. We're going to use Rowan. He's got some nice gear, and we're just going to throw whatever's left under him. Not bad. Not bad at all. Okay, we'll take it. That should be pretty fine. That should be pretty fine. So we're going to go with 
the Belinda, Rosaline, Rowan, Lawson, and I hadn't considered the final member of the team. I haven't considered it. Maybe we, we, we boost Rain. Maybe we throw Rain in there. Unfortunately, I don't have the, uh, the Lucius, but uh, we, we, can, we can throw the Rain in there. Let's, let's chuck her in the crystal. Got plenty of spots on this account. Do that. Now, I know this is being stupid. Don't worry. I'll reset things and I'll get, get this all sorted later on. But for now, we're trying to speed through it. So, you can have not that gear. You can have this gear. We will test the Thalia in it once she gets to 240 as well. Because I feel like she'll be awesome. So, Rain's sort of my next best damage dealer in the team. Because the rest are just supports. So, we're going to throw that on it. And then, we're going to give... I don't know if I want to do Rowan or Rosaline with the horn. I think we'll just leave it like that. Uh, and we'll give him Grace just because he's going to need that shield because he's going to be super squishy. Uh, she's got it. And I can't be bothered changing anything else up. So let's just go for that one. <laughs> That'll do. Okay, let's jump into it. Let's jump into it. Let's see if we can get some damage. Now this this account, unless I swap all my gear up and make my rain 240 and all that, I haven't been able to crack the 100 mil. Just, just the way it is. I'm bad. I get it. I get it. So let's challenge and let's see what we can do. So we're going to drop that. We're going to put her front row so she can take some deeps. Uh, that should be all good. Maybe because I find that they normally attack... Um, attack top he normally attacks top i find at least so we'll see and then we're going to throw in the squishy squishy lawson let's see what happens so if we if we get 100 mil i'll be pretty pumped pretty pretty pumped because even though my account has three 240 heroes we're only using one of them because i don't want shimira or k-source to get boosted via rosaline let's see what happens let's see what happens hopefully 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 we get something good out of it Okay, we, I want to see. I want to see her ult and see what happens. We got the attack buff, the marks on five million to eleven million, almost twelve million. Okay, that is huge, deeps. Check this out. Boom! It just it erupts. I love Belinda. This is sick. Oh my god, I've been doing this all wrong. I I needed to ascend my Belinda way sooner. Look at this damage. Like okay, simply overpowered. This is sick. This is okay. Like literally, I, with my team where it was, I couldn't actually get above 100 mil. Uh, obviously, getting past 100 mil so early means a massive rip. But you can see that if you had your heroes higher ascended, um, that's going to be nice. Like my Shimira, like my team would survive till time out and not do that much damage. Like and okay, for for argument's sake. So, so the reason, if anyone's confused about Lawson, the reason he's so good and the unfortunate thing about it at the same time is this ability here. Lawson attacks an enemy for 170% damage, marks them with his inner sight symbol. I couldn't read that while I was reading it, so I read it really slow. Yes, bad reader. English wasn't my thing. Which persists until the end of the battle. The symbol allows for all the ultimate ability damage of all allied heroes to be raised by 160% against the marked enemy for four seconds when the ultimate ability is used. So the four seconds thing, I think, I'm pretty sure the reason he doesn't work as well with, with Shimira is because it's only for four seconds after they cast it, Shimira's last longer. Correct me if I'm wrong on that, anyone, but that's the way I think it works. And with Belinda, her whole damage from her ultimate comes in that first four seconds. So that's why she's amazing for it. Um, when an ultimate ability is used, the ability prioritized unmarked hero. Yeah, so he basically marks different heroes every time. Doesn't really matter. But as you can see, level four upgrade, ultimate ability damage dealt to marked enemies by all allied heroes increased to 220%. So it just makes Belinda absolutely demolish him. Unfortunately, this mark does get removed um, if he dies. So that's the one unfortunate thing. But hey, it's, it's, it's not too bad. So what we're going to do is we're going to throw that same team in. We'll make a change. We'll take Lawson out. Uh, I don't know what we'll put in. We'll put in something. Haven't thought that far ahead. Maybe we'll put in like... Maybe I'll put some gear on Athalia and throw her in there. Uh, let's see. What can we do that's sort of... What we'll do is we'll put... We'll put Athalia in. Because... Yeah. Because Athalia is Athalia. We'll, we'll just do that. So we'll just put our next best set on her. 
Actually, no, we'll, we'll, we'll remove this set. We'll equip that to her. We'll move that to her. And we'll give her that one. Like, we're, we're going to give Vithalia every chance to out-damage what we were doing before. And she can have... Uh, that one. That'll do. Let's see what happens. So I, I'm tipping our damage is going to be lower. However, we may survive longer and get there again. But that the burst damage if your team can survive, that is huge by the blender. Like absolutely huge. Uh, let's check it. Okay. Guild hunting, please. Okay. So now let's drop him, put her in. Let's see what happens. Now we have a five faction bonus as well. Let's see. All unverified testing, just going with it, but Belinda definitely just the, the, the number one choice for Riz. Take, like, no doubt. Like, I love Belinda in Riz. This is nice. Okay, let's see what kind of damage we're getting. The damage from her ultimate doesn't seem as high. As you can see, it's, it's, it's missing pretty much, it, it's pretty much doing half the damage that it was because the Lawson thing makes it 220%. Still, we're doing all right. So what might happen here is we might not get the damage up that high to start. So we might survive the first ultimate from Riz. Um, and then, yeah, so we might survive. Rowan did die, but now we might even ramp up the damage to that 100 mil because we survived long enough to get it. Let's see. And I mean, Belinda being so self-sufficient, like she's got a big normal attack as well and not normal attack, but you know, the little ball she throws. And then she's also got the self-attack buff. She's got a nice crit rate. She's just all round good. And let's see. Okay, I think we will still get to the... No, we won't. And there you go. And you see how long it took us to get there. Uh, just basically Lawson is the man to go with it. But just the elite Lawson just completely trashed it. So let's, let's go back here. Let's just swap that out. We're not going to play around with the gear again. Let's go find the Lawson. Let's do it. And see what happens. This is going to be good again. Like, as soon as that mark goes on, and then we get the Rowan attack buff, and she ults, it's just game over. So we're going from 6-6 six, six to 21, 22, like, in that ult. 25 to 43. <laughs> it's huge. Doing, like, 15 to 20 million damage every time she ults. Like, look at it. It just scales so quickly. He hasn't even... So Riz hasn't done a single ult yet, and we're above 100 million, and that's the problem. Now we're just dead when he ults. As you can see, everyone drops. And you lose that mark, and you lose a lot of the damage, but that is very, very quick ramping damage. If I could get that team to survive the 100k, um, the 100 mil damage ult, I think we'd be pretty much set. Let's have a look at this. Yeah, that's, that's pretty huge. That is absolutely huge. So... For, like, I know I should have done a control test with Shimira, but if you guys seen my previous videos, around 100 mil was my max, like, at going full duration. So that is absolutely huge for me. Absolutely love it. Get get around the Belinda. Um, we're going to we're gonna leave it there for this video because I am really short on time. i got to go to work, and it's already been, I think, a 10 to 15 minute video. So what we're going to do, do, if you guys want me to try and push campaign with Belinda, let me know in the comments below. I'm happy to do it. I don't know how well we'll go, but hey, we can always try it and see what happens. We'd probably do a Belinda K source. What would the team be? Belinda K source. Probably put the Rowan in there. Oh man, Athalia ascended. I think I think Athalia ascended is really coming close. Like, wait, if we go if we go over here, oh, I think we got it. Store, please. I love I love these being purchasable for gold. That is great. Chuck. We've got it. Okay. Let me know if you want me to do a Belinda push, but uh, I don't know. I'm kind of tempted just to jump straight into the Athalia and do that first. But uh, but yeah, that's going to be for this one, guys. Belinda, an absolute beast. Put Lawson with her, and it's amazing. Even just the lead, you'll get massive Riz damage. So thanks for watching, guys, and I'll look forward to seeing you in the next one. Cheers.